Hello everybody, today let's go over a, another trade vision video and I want to show you the support and the resistance indicator and how you can use it to your advantage to ensure that you are trading properly and you can continue to discover your edge in the market. I'm going to go ahead and head over to the visualizer right here and I'm simply going to look up a stock. You can also be going on your screener or your watch list and you can choose any other stock. But I want to go ahead and click on visualizer. I'm going to go ahead and search up SPY. It's in my recents right here. Okay, so now I have the SPY chart loaded up here. And as you can see, I currently have the support indicator active. That's the one we want to be looking at. I'm going to unclick the trend indicator because I don't need it right now. I just want to look at simple support. So in a previous video, we talked about how the call and the put walls right here, these green bars on the right, and also these red bars here on the left can help you identify support and resistance. The call options are good indicators of potential resistance levels and the puts are good indicators of potential support levels. Well, that made it easy to hopefully identify some key levels in the market. However, Trade Vision has now made it even easier and it does it for you and it identifies these key levels based off of the continual aggregate open interest of all the expiration dates summed up together, which is fantastic. So all these dates up here that you see, right? no matter which date I click on, I can go to October 31st, I can go to November 5th, November 8th, let's keep going, right? the 29th, 32 days, I can go to the 6th, 39 days, I can go to the 20th, 53 days, whatever you choose, it's going to give you the strongest resistance levels on the S&P 500, and it'll also give you the strongest support levels on the S&P 500. Okay, so the goal of this indicator is simply to summarize all of these bars right here both on the left and the right and put it into one simple context one simple context support resistance and there you have it let's go ahead and look at a different chart i'll search up avgo i believe we did this one in one of the last videos of the call and put walls let's see where it lines up now all right, so now it's giving us the biggest key levels here, support resistance at 180 and, or we have resistance at 180 and we have support at, at 140. Okay, seems pretty adequate, honestly, just by even looking at the chart here, right? What happens if I take off the support and resistance? Well, let's do some charting ourselves, right? If I really wanted to, I could really just say, hey, you know what, we have a huge support level around here, or excuse me, a huge resistance level up here, and we also have some supports right around down here, right? You can, you know, it doesn't have to be perfect. It's just definitely more of like a range kind of scenario. But even if I were to do this myself, I can always double check my work as well. Support resistance, okay, boom. Resistance at 180, support at 140. We're in the ballpark. This will give us extra confirmation, right? And let's go ahead and try another one. Let's do, let's do IWM, the Russell 2000. So Russell 2000, okay, I'm gonna take these off. All right, so I see resistance up here and then I see maybe support down here let's try it wow look at that okay so I was a little off of my resistance I resistance um, about 226 so in the ballpark though 225 to 230 okay 230 right here I marked mine around 226 still right there and then we also have the support levels at 210 so overall everyone it's just a great and easy simple kind of news flash boom support resistance here just be mindful of it and it's and it's a overall a great tool that you can use in your trading and of course definitely use some other indicators and you know you can always add this to your process i wouldn't completely rely on the support and resistance because anything can always happen in the markets but it's still a great tool nonetheless and it should definitely give you some good good great confirmation in your trading and in your processes thank you for watching and i hope you found some great utility out